Never buckle, never fold, never stop working hard. Be the hardest worker in every room. And where there's a will, there's a way. Will finds a way. Okay, it's late, I'm in pain, it's time to go to work. Stay fit. All right guys, it's been a long day. It's been a long day. We're putting the bag up, we're getting shit out of the All right, let's do a quick 10 minute workout. Pardon me Elaine, balls to the wall. No holds barred. Uh, let's do it because I'm in a lot of pain and this is the only thing that makes me think of something else. And then we're gonna try to go to sleep and get some rest, fix these broken eyes, all right? Come on, Elaine, follow me. All right, let's see what we're working with here. Get that sign, it's a good sign. All right, all right. My friend Elaine is a videographer today, videographer extraordinaire, Elaine DeMillo, nice to see you. All right, she traveled with me all the way from Belmont, New, Belmont, New Hampshire. And now we are here in Boston. No, no Connecticut. 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 We don't know where we are, that's Somewhere. a fact. Okay, all right, so for the sake of uh, making quick moves, I'm not taking the bag off my back. I'm taking the hood off my head. I'm putting the headphones on because they give me focus. Elaine, follow me. All right, this one, this one DJ, Dwayne Rock Johnson, it is for you. We're we'll good, done. All right, all right. DJ, I'm putting on the bag and using it as a weight, okay? I got the shoes, I got the bag, I got everything else in between. This bag right now weighs about 35, maybe 40 pounds. We'll buy my ass. Elaine, ready? Ready, three, two, one. Let me know when 10 minutes is up. Okay, Elaine, follow the process. The slower I go, the harder it burns, the better it is for my muscles. I'm in a lot of pain physically. Elaine, get close over here and come into my, my triceps and my biceps and, and show the audience what, what you see. Now come around behind me. Try to be fluid motions up or down or around my body. That's three, Rock. That's three with about 35 to 40 pounds on my back. And I'm doing it slow because I'm gonna sweat faster if I go slower. I'm gonna breathe. In four seconds through my nose, out eight seconds through my mouth, like pursed lips like whistle but no sound because it's gonna keep me calm even though it's painful. But the workout, and the physical pain my body's in already because of my skin disease. I've been holding this pose for some time, right, Elaine? Yeah. I'm not going down. I'm not going down because the longer I hold it here, the harder it becomes. Three, two, squeeze by me. There we go. Ready?
Come on, Heinz. Come on. Ugh. Yeah. Oh, man. I tried to hang on longer, Rock. I couldn't do it. Active rest, Rock. Active rest. The bag's not built for that. No offense, Rock. It's not built for that. But it is built really, really well. Under Armour and DJ, this is my favorite bag of all time. Good Lord, I take it every airport around the world, 320 days a year I take this bag with me. It's on my back. And I do airport workouts, CJ, every day. People look at me like I'm a <laughs> maniac. But when you're in pain, DJ, physical pain 24 hours a day, as it often happens to me. You gotta do what you gotta do to mitigate that pain. And people can stare at you and that's their <laughs> problem. Come on. I'm gonna do as many rapid dips as humanly possible. Guys at home, get to your dip machine. Hell, you get a counter in your house that goes like this. You can do dips. You got an island in the kitchen and a sink that's at the same height. You can do dips. Hell, if it's a different height, it's staggered dips. All right, you can find a way to do dips anywhere. And they're one of the best exercises in the world. And DJ, I know you love them. You do them with a chain around your neck. I do them with your bag around my back. And you know what, DJ? Let's do your bag around my back and a weight at my feet, because you would. Let's go. Elaine, how many dips can I, how much weight can I do with a dip? I'm gonna be modest and say 20 pounds, because this bag's already 30 or 40. Here we go, DJ. This is for you. Come on, Heinz, don't let DJ down. This is the 20 pounds. Three, four. Here, Jay, come up here, Jay. Michael pulses. This rack of weights. We've got all the way to 97.5 pounds. Let's see how much of that we can try to pull down. Are you ready? Okay, Lane. Are you ready to pull? Are you ready to pull? Are you ready to do it? Ninety-seven pounds, Lane. I am. You're gonna do it. I'll do it. You're gonna take this and you're gonna do it. Fine. I'll do it. Get out of here. <laughs> All right. All right, Elaine's kidding. Here we go. Elaine, come watch me put ninety-seven on here. Let's be clear. I don't think I can do ninety-seven. But Elaine, nothing happens without hard work, and hard work doesn't work if you don't try, does it? So, DJ could definitely do ninety-seven pounds. I'm a little smaller than he is. Right, Gwen? I don't think I can do it. But if I can, at least once, I'll be the happiest man in the world. I don't think I can do this. But I've done things I haven't thought I could do. Three, with the Rocks bag, the Rocks shoes, and the Rocks headphones, maybe I can. Three, we've done this before. Three, look at that way one more time. Make sure it's real. Okay, let's. Okay, here we go. This is gonna be embarrassing, but I can't do it. Three, two, all right, Elaine, here. Dwayne, epic fail. But you taught me something. Even if you didn't know you did, Dwayne. There are no failures in life. Failure doesn't exist if you keep trying until you succeed. So we're gonna end the video like this. I'm gonna go down to the weight that I can do. And I'm gonna do that as many times as I can until fail. And then Lane's gonna go to bed. But Dwayne, I promise you, with this bag, these headphones, and these shoes, get in those shoes. Get that brown bowl right there. See it? With your 
believing in me as a project, Dwayne. Whether I ever meet you in person or not is not the point. Someday I will, I promise. And someday you'll shake my hand and someday, Dwayne, I'll say thank you for saving my life in person. Anyway, that said, that was an epic fail, but there are no failures in life, so f*** that. I'm a winner. I'm a champion. Literally, WCL wrestling champion, varsity. When I was at JV, I kicked that guy's ass. He was bigger than me. He looked like Wolverine. I'm gonna do what weight I can. I'm gonna do it as many times as it'll fail. Then we're gonna go to bed. But I'm gonna work at this every day until I hit lane. Until I get from some tricep machine that lets me go past 100 pounds. And I'm gonna do it, Dwayne, someday, soon, at least 10 times. But right now, let's do what we can do, because that's what we came here to do. Let's get it done. Lane, we're going down. Let me see, I couldn't do 97, but I can get halfway down. Let's go for 92. Let's go until we find something that we can't do. This is probably not bad. Oh, yes! You got it, Lane? Come right. Wait, that's only three, that's not good enough. We're almost done, Lane. Never give up, never give in, never buckle, never fold, never stop working hard, be the hardest worker in every room, and where there's a will, there's a way, will finds a way. Last set, last set I promise Elaine. We're gonna go from 82 down to 62.5. And we're gonna do triceps till fail. So this is not a complete botch of a workout. Where I'm talking too much and not working out. And DJ hates that. And there are no mirrors in Dwayne The Rock Johnson's iron paradise. Cause he's not a vain man. He's a man with a mission. And he gets shit done in that gym that he travels with all around the world. I have dreams and aspirations, DJ. And every dream I've ever had in my life, I've made come true. <laughs> <laughs>